Golan's full of he's Golan's one of these players that never underestimates anyone. Doesn't matter who he's playing. He's uh, he's a consummate professional. Isn't he is. He? Yeah, Golan. he's hugely intense, and there is a confidence level, of course, with him. But he just does not take any chances against lower rank players. A few errors from James, though. He's not settled whatsoever in this first game so far. I mean, obviously, a lot of that is down to the fact that Golan's hitting his targets incredibly well. Wow, it's all Golan here. Anything loose from James is being picked off. He's going to be eyeing up a bagel. Is the Spaniard or a donut? So Borja Golan with nine game balls, very convincing first game. It's certainly been working on that lob, Golan. Wow, beautiful squash, nice terrific finish. squash from the Spanish ball, El Toro. They do struggle with that door, don't they? <laughs> yeah, it's not opening very well. It's not opening so well. Again, Golan just managing to get the ball moving away from James. Five left. And out. One seven. For Golan. What he's got to do is, when Golan is holding, Declan James has to just slow it down and obviously look to time his split step as his opponent hits the ball, rather than when the opponent is setting up to hit the ball. Well, the Spaniard has been exactly the same in the second game. He's struggling to read go there. It's the first time they've played, you know, on the PSA World Tour, these two players. <laughs> and Golan really is not an easy player to play no, for the first time. Very, very unorthodox. El Toro is a one-off. It's good to see that. Brilliant going through and playing that ball. It's unlucky. Another slip for Golan. Yeah, there's been a couple in that front right. He got really irritated one before, but and of course... We know he suffered oh. from some major injuries in his career, Golan. Great to see that through playing his boast and then the decent huge slip. You see him marking the floor. Golan's got a hold in his swing on pretty much every shot. Now that's better play from James and that's an example of what the younger Englishman can do. Lovely open racket face. He's very tall, bending down on that ball leg. There you go, it's a nice finish from Declan James. Looking to get the crowd behind him. Responding quite nicely as well. Yeah, he went for it. It's quality from James. I'm trying to get the crowd going. It's good. Good for him. Don't say it's not been entertaining this last uh, this last third game. Oh goodness me, look at this. Well it's a clever shot, always really difficult to judge these. Oh, it's been given as a stroke, but of course he's just used his player review. 
So Declan James shakes the hand, leaves his mark on the court. Played a fantastic third game, Declan James. Managed to sort himself. Borja Golan needs to calm down slightly. <laughs> He's going to have an interview with uh, Alan Thatcher. But at 44 minutes, and it's Borja Golan well, that overcomes James. Three games to love. Oh, oh. <laughs>